Well, currently, the majority of our transportation infrastructure, so the roads and the bridges that we use and drive every day, are funded by a fuel tax that we pay on every gallon when we fuel up our cars at the pump. So as cars become more fuel efficient and there's more electric vehicles on the road, the purchasing power of that fuel tax is diminishing, while at the same time, the cost to maintain that infrastructure continues to increase. Well, there are a number of states right now that are starting to look at the feasibility of using a mileage-based user fee instead of a gas tax. So rather than paying at the pump every time you fill up your car, drivers would be charged a fee for every mile that they drive. Currently, Burns and McDonald is working with the I-95 Corridor Coalition on a mileage-based user fee pilot study. And our role in this is to help communicate why we need to look at alternative ways to fund transportation in the future, and then also to recruit and engage individual participants in the pilot. It ultimately, it is about the end user, the folks that are gonna be driving the vehicle, that are paying, whether it's a gas tax or a mileage-based user fee or some other funding mechanism that's yet to be determined. So understanding how citizens perceive and understand these issues is really critical to any type of project.